To make a clean 3D interactive site like this, all you will need is these two packs and a Shopify account. I'm leaving all the links down below. Creating a Shopify account is really easy. Just go to shopify.com and follow the steps. And if you are interested, you can get a free trial if you use the link in the description. After creating your account, just go to your online store, then click on Themes and upload the FKX Premium Theme zip file. Once you have that done, it's time to upload the 3D GLB logo that will make your site interactive. But where do I get one done? If you click the link for the 3D GLB logo package that's in the description, once again, it will take you to this page. You just need to upload your logo and choose a color of your choice, then after two days you will receive an email with the GLB file attached. Once you receive it, go ahead and upload it to Shopify. To do so, just go back to the Shopify dashboard, click on Content, then Files and Upload File, choose your 3D GLB logo file, and wait until it's uploaded to copy. It's linked by clicking on the clip icon that's now on that your Now that the right. link to the file is copied, go back to the theme section of your Shopify store and click on the Customize button that's right next to your FKX Premium theme, and you will be taken to the Customization page where you can fully customize your site. For this tutorial, we will just teach you how to make your site interactive with the FKX Premium theme by uploading a 3D GLB logo, but there are many other features that will help you make a game-changing site and get more orders. So if you want to see all the features it has and know how it works to fully take advantage of this theme, check out this tutorial. All right, having that said now, all you need to do is click on the Enter Page section that's on your left, Scroll down until you see the GLB logo feature and paste the link you copied earlier in this box. Save all changes and it's done. Now you have a next level 3D interactive site. Publish it once you finish editing it and check out your brand new website. Hope you liked this video. Subscribe for more tutorials and tips we got too. See ya.